and my name is Mark Windle and I'm a pilot with Air Tanker. I'm a sponsored reserve pilot, so most of the time I spend flying the A330 on behalf of Air Tanker, but I'm also, as I said, a sponsored reserve pilot, so I fly the RAF Voyager for uh, 10 Squadron. I joined Air Tanker because I love flying. I was already A330 qualified prior to joining Air Tanker, uh, but I was an air cadet uh, at a young age, and the opportunity to become a sponsored reserve pilot and flying uh, with the RAF as well as uh, the civilian organisation uh, had the best of both worlds. The sponsor reservist concept here at Air Tanker is unique in the Ministry of Defence. It is a role that sits both with feet in both camps, the civilian and the military camp. It will support the military registered aircraft in uniform when down route and also will support the civilian aircraft in Air Tanker uniform back here at the hub. The best thing about working for Air Tanker is the variety. No day is the same. Uh, since we've started operations I've flown as far as Las Vegas, Calgary and going eastwards, uh, Dubai and Penang, Malaysia. I'm Flight Lieutenant Nathan Jones and I'm a pilot on 10 Squadron. Yeah, working with the sponsor reservists has actually worked really well for me. I, I've really enjoyed it, especially as some of the guys are ex-colleagues on, on 101 Squadron for the VC-10s. They might have gone out to Virgin, BA, gone to work for the airlines and then they've come back as sponsor reservists for Air Tanker. Um, and because of that, we're actually flying with them. They're putting their green flying suits back on and, uh, and getting into operational flying, which I'm sure is great for them and it's definitely great for us having them back and imparting their knowledge for us. The, the, the breadth of knowledge that those guys have was just second to none. I mean, we, will have, we were trading stories whilst we were going through the, through the training program and we'll have very, very different stories, but one of my instructors had 24,000 hours of flying, so I don't know anyone else that's got that breadth of knowledge and experience with flying. So to be able to pass that on to us um, new guys onto such a brand new fleet was, uh, was amazing. As a sponsored reservist, we act as primarily trainers. So uh, myself and my colleagues have a lot of experience flying uh, Airbus A330 aircraft, the civilian version of Voyager. Uh, we bring that expertise into the Air Tanker Services RAF uh, construct here and it enables us to provide that expertise to the RAF. Um, I know how the, the RAF ground crew system works and to see the guys fix the aircraft uh, in Air Tanker it's, it's, it's really interesting and to see the ground crew both wearing the same sort of overalls when they go down route as well uh, as the sponsored reservists fly in the military kit um, and they're explaining things about how they operate and I've flown with quite a few uh, sponsored reserve pilots as well and again you know, they've been explaining how things are done in civilian life compared to the military. In the MSO role there are a few uh, sponsored reserve pilots that are now AAR qualified um, in fact one of them is um, uh, an instructor in the role um, who you know have brought so much knowledge in the aircraft we know how to operate the aircraft in the AAR role they know more about the aircraft as a whole uh, so with that sort of knowledge coupled with our knowledge of AAR operations it's, it's been a really really successful uh, way of doing things. A highlight for me since joining Air Tanker was receiving my RAF wings uh, we really weren't expecting to receive those when we came here uh, so that's been a really nice surprise and a, a recognition, I think, that the RAF have accepted us as part of their team, part of the squadrons, and it's something that's meant an awful lot to my colleagues and myself. Mm -hmm.